What is up guys? It is simply Pops and now we are like a week away from Call of Duty Ghosts and I'm and I seem to love doing these Call of Duty Ghosts news. I'm pretty sure you guys are loving it. Leaving likes on videos. I really do appreciate that. And hopefully you're you're a subscriber too if you bump into me. Make sure you subscribe. But anyway, let's get to today's topic. Now, Call of Duty Ghosts for the Xbox 360 version will feature two discs. Now, I'm kind of a big fan of the two discs for the Xbox 360 version because name one game that has two discs that's a bad game. You know, Grand Theft Auto 5 featured two discs, Battlefield 3 featured two discs, and both of those two games are great games. Hopefully, Call of Duty Ghosts is a good game like that. And obviously, the game is so, the game is big, that's what she said, to fit in one disc for the Xbox 360 version. So, I think this is how it's going to go, one disc is the play, the second disc is the installation disc. Now it's going to take up like either 8 gigs or 4 gigs on your Xbox 360 hard drive so make sure you clear out your space. I know Grand Theft Auto 5 is probably holding up the space and stuff but make room, I'm pretty sure you can delete some demos and stuff like that. But yeah, I don't know, hopefully it's not like this. Where one disc is campaign, the other disc is multiplayer. I hate that. Hopefully they don't do it like that. Because I am not a fan of that. Because let's say you want to play multiplayer. Then I got to take out the campaign disc and swap the multiplayer. You got to stop what you're doing. Get up. You know, I'm a type of gamer to just like sitting down and just enjoying the game without needing to switch disc. That's completely old school. Now, only reason why I brought that up because Battlefield 3 was like that, where you have campaign on one disc and the. But reality, people are just gonna play the multiplayer, right? But there is a special mode, so I don't know what this would that be. But hopefully, it's not like that. Hopefully, I have one disc, one game disc, and one installation disc. Now, I might get it for PS3 most likely because you know a lot of subscribers have it for PS3. Well, have it or well, pre-ordering it for PS3. Than Xbox subscribers, and I don't know. I'm getting it on PS3, and that is it, guys. Just giving you guys a little heads up. Make sure you s delete something to, to get, reserve your 4 gigs or 8 gigs of space storage. I will have a little bit more in depth on this topic in the description. I will have links and you know, topics and stuff like that. Make sure you subscribe if you're new, and I hope you guys have a Bless day and stay simple.